after coming so far i was really left out uh, i think in the end freddy will come uh, and uh, uh, i think uh, without taking much time uh, the reason of our coming basically i want to let all of us know uh, because you no know, we are living in a time which is very very uh, you know demanding a lot of demands are there things are changing very rapidly which we beyond expression and imagination can think that things are not going to be as it is and now we are so you know, this was the burden that was shared by uncle uh, and uh, recently he asked me to take up this responsibility of dean of development and then uh, earlier i was taking care of the dean of student affairs and i wanted to you know relax for some time stay back uh, but uncle came and told that now you have to travel uh, with me when i am in india and uh, john george sir is taking care in uh, in the bss uh, talking about the schools and different ministries that we have and as we all rightly said who know who are we and what we have become i know god has given us uh, the grace i'm not avoiding that particular fact but god has given us this particular opportunity but god has also joined us as a family we have become a family uh, who has been blessed tremendously whether no we have been i was listening to every conversation that we have and every one of us very vibrantly told different experiences that we had as students and uh, i was a student i know the initial stages of our uh, college and how college grew up to the stature that we have god has been so graciously leading us and now uncle george because he is getting very you know he himself said i am getting older and things are going to be different he said that why not we as no community of uh, alumni or those who have graduated you no know, connect together and uh, as many of you said that i did not know him this platform really helped us to be connected with seniors super seniors and teachers and i surely believe that this is a good start that god has given good start that god has given and god is a god who no honor small beginnings and i think we from the very beginning of our uh, no meeting i know time is very short i'm not going to take i had prepared a small uh, no biblical passage to deal with uh, interconnected with our no uh, our roots so that was the title that i had prepared but time because we all wanted to share and pour out our hearts interconnected with the roots and i think we are trying to connect with the roots that we have and bible gives lot of imagery where uh, the trees are seen being planted by the side of the river and how we as people of god who have been planted in different times of our stay in ntc we can see that god has planted us we got connected with god because we trusted god but at the same time when we live together when we stand together we can accomplish much no we can accomplish much recently we went to uh, andhra pradesh and we saw so many friends and we shared the concern that uncle had shared and uncle was telling like it's high time for us to come together and we have this ministry which is our ministry it is not one individual ministry it is our ministry and we all have been blessed as a family so he was sharing please share my heart to everyone of our uh, beloved alumni who are serving the lord who are blessed and this when we shared in the andhra uh, group of uh, graduates they responded really well i never expected such a response i uh, know john sir is also here and when we shared about this they said sir we will start as a group to sponsor uh, maybe one or two in the beginning and they came up with an amount very small amount and they calculated and said if we can you know if we give 100 rupees for example if there are 100 graduates in andhra if 100 rupees every month this is a very minimal amount they said people are 
uh, they can give you no know, much more than 100 i know so if 100 rupees is given that becomes 1200 for an individual and if that is being collected all through the year one person can be easily supported many of us who are sitting here you know many of us were supported by ntc you know i think you no know, if we say look back even if we had paid full fees the full fees when compared to ubs or compared to sacs or utc is comparatively very less i studied in you no know, utc i know what's the what's the fee of that particular college sacs i know how much uh, they pay you no know? so we have been blessed if we had paid the whole amount also it will come to some place where the ntc has contributed and i surely believe that all of us were blessed maybe partially or they you know a general scholarship or you no know, waived off with much of our uh, fee structure at that particular time so it's now our turn to return with gratitude i think you know we need to always have that gratitude aspect in our life and if we look back we can easily say lord i am willing to give much more and they said that this is a small beginning that we are going to start with but this will ultimately lead to at least minimum five people being sponsored by andhra group you know so that was with very clearly they spelled out and we will work it out and they said we will work it out so we thought we will share it with and now ntc graduates of kerala and i think we all can generously help and stand along no we we know uncle is a fatherly figure everyone said i think everyone in different intervals told about uncle how much impact he has made and i see him as a fatherly figure you know i see him as a fatherly figure whom we can easily you know uh follow the example that he has set and also to stand with him will be really really good in this particular time so i would not take much time it is time for us to come back to the the institution that we had studied which has been blessing us in the past and i surely believe i personally myself will take you know every effort to do whatever i can do it's not that i am telling others but as a, a graduate of ntc i will try my level best to do what i can for raising at least whatever i can so if as a community of uh, people who are based in kerala if someone takes the initiative let's do something every month no if it is just 500 rupees we go to a, a restaurant and we spend uh, more than that no in 500 rupees you don't get anything nowadays so if we give 500 rupees a month slowly if we have 100 people no we can sponsor five people and reduce the the you know the board burden of uncle and auntie so i surely believe if we come with a with the same mind and pull the rope together you no know, we always play uh, tug of war in ntc and a tug of war is a very beautiful stage of uh, you know sports life where everyone comes i see during the tug of war everyone comes no matter whether that person is interested or not everyone and everyone when they pull together you can see the difference of winning it's not just one person pulling but when everyone pulls together i think we can really make a difference so if we you know take up whatever god has blessed us with with minimal thing that we have you may say oh sir just now i completed my studies and it may appear to be very very insignificant for me but if we start with a small amount i think god will really honor and we had a very good example no pastor uh, um, no poppy poppy daniel uh, he he just mentioned about it and if we start venturing in faith god will honor god will honor so this is what my concern that we want i wanted to share on behalf of uncle we have lot of projects many schools many children who do not have who are deprived of education you know your generous support of even little amount will really 
make a difference in the life of uh, small children. So I know uh, I may appear like this, but I do not feel any bad about it because this we are doing for the Lord. And many people gave sacrificially when we went. And everything we have written down. Even 500 rupees someone gave saying, Sir, this is for you. We had written down the receipt and sent the receipt. And we will make the receipt in the college. So even us, 100 rupees or 500 rupees is given. I know uncle has been very meticulous, very transparent. Whatever amount is being given, he never misuses. And we have such a wonderful leader in him. And that, no, we have learned from his life. I have learned from his life. So this is, I think, everyone could certify that uh, this will be a very good adventure of walking with him, uh, taking the concern, shouldering the responsibility. And now 